show you hopefully how to do a smoky eye. And I'm going to use our new splurge spec um, spectacle in color. It is a beautiful color. It's almost got a silver um, tone to it. It is gorgeous. So let's see what happens. And a little goes a long ways. The thing about um, our splurges, again, on any of our makeup, is you want to make sure you're using it and make sure you close all the lids because it will dry out. So I'm just going to stop at, start at the bottom and I'm going to pull all the way up. And I'm not going to go very far because I'm actually going to do another color on top of it so I don't look like I have a black eye. I just want a smoky eye. So. for the other eye and you can see I put it on pretty thick right here nice thing about um, our splurges they go on like butter so they're so smooth and when you open your eye they're not sticky so it's not like you're opening your eye and you feel like you have like um, a sticky eyeshadow on nothing sticky about our products and I love that so I'm just going to go up here a little bit I'm going to do is take our Confident. Confident is a matte um, brown. So since this has sparkle in it already, I like the matte with it because it's actually going to give it um, a little bit of depth. And I'm going to use our two-toned brush. So I'm, I'm actually not going to get it wet this time. I get a lot of our pigments wet. I love them wet. But because it's going to go right on top of my um, splurge, the splurge adheres like a primer, so you don't really have to get it all wet because it's going to just blend in there with it. So what I do now it looks funny and it looks like a mess right now. That's okay because it is going to all blend in a minute. Now, you guys have Christmas parties, New Year's parties, um, Thanksgiving's right around the corner. All this is coming up, so you are gonna need your smoky eye. This is like your black dress go-to. Love this stuff, so. I'm gonna just blend now with my blender. last for the top part I'm going to put angelic this also is a matte um, it's almost like a whitish skin skin tone yellow for me I love this as a brow top and I'm just gonna blend it in right here with this kind of just brings it all together Now remember, I'm not a makeup artist, um, I'm just a mom, and with a daughter who really doesn't like makeup yet, um, so you do it your way, you do it what works for you. When you get your makeup, you put it on the way that works for you. If I can do this though, anyone can. This is, not, I, this is nothing fancy, very simple. So now, as you can see, I did the spectacle on the bottom, and then right in my crease, and I have deep eyes and droopy eyelids, so I actually should go a little bit higher onto my bone so it gives me more of a look. And then for this part, it's just the Angelica wipes. So now I'm just going to blend it a little bit. Just a little, not too much. And I'm not going to go down into the spectacle because I don't really want to blend that. I want it to stay kind of right there so that it pops. actually do your liner with it.
and your liner on the bottom. If you do liner on the bottom. I only do it a little ways. People say if you do liner on the bottom, it you know changes your eyes, which is true. So whatever works for you. I do do it a little bit. Maybe it's old school habit. Love it, love it. A little bit more here on the bottom here. Once again, make sure you close all your products because they will dry out. So if you're like me and messy and you leave it everywhere, um, it won't turn out in the long run. <laughs> so there's that. I'm just going to wipe off a little bit.